Learn from God to enlighten your soul. This is your daily devotional reading. Our Father cares, May 20th, the Mighty Deliverer. I have spread out my hands all the day unto a rebellious people, which walketh in a way that was not good after their own thoughts. Isaiah 65 verse 2 The Lord God through Christ holds out his hand all the day long in invitations to the needy. He will receive all. He welcomes all. He rejects none. It is his glory to pardon the chief of sinners. He will take the prey from the mighty. He will deliver the captive. He will pluck the brand from the burning. He will lower the golden chain of his mercy to the greatest depth of human wretchedness and guilt and lift up the debased soul contaminated with sin. But man must will to come and cooperate in the work of saving his soul by availing himself of opportunities given him of God. The Lord forces no one. The spotless wedding robe of Christ's righteousness is prepared to clothe the sinner, but if he refuses it, he must perish. The record of the past can be blotted out with Christ's blood, the page made clean and white. Come now, and let us reason together, saith the Lord. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow, though they be red like crimson, they shall be as wool. Isaiah 1 verse 18 The words falling from the lips of Jesus, Thy sins be forgiven thee, Matthew 9 verse 2, are worth everything to us. He says, I have borne your sin in my own body on Calvary's cross. He sees your sorrows. His hand is laid upon the head of every contrite soul, and Jesus becomes our advocate before the Father and our Savior. The lowly, contrite heart will make very much of forgiveness and pardon. We may repeat His tender compassion for us to others who are wandering in the mazes of sin. The grace of Christ revealed to us must be tenderly revealed to others. A great tenderness and compassion will fill the soul for human beings who are still under the control of Satan. Christ is to be multiplied in every man and woman who believes in him, for they are to live over the life of Christ in blessing and enlightening and bringing hope and peace and joy to other hearts. Our Father cares, May 20th.